Graffiti is a major part of the hip hop community, and if you're driving throughout the inner city, you can see tons of graffiti pieces along the side of building walls. If you're in Baltimore, that means you're looking at a lot of work from the writer, Verse One. He's one of the area's most respected artists. I've been writing since about the late 80s. Uh, I got into it in, in, in junior high school back in the day. You know what I'm saying? It all started like from comic books to um, movies showing graffiti and it just started capturing me more and more. And I just started writing, 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 writing and practicing over and over and over again until I got, you know, to a level where I thought I was, you know, thought I was nice or whatever. I'm still trying to get to that level, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm still practicing. Some people view graffiti writing as gang-affiliated messages, but for real hip-hop fans and graffiti artists, that couldn't be further from the truth. It's not only a culture, but a true art form as well. This is this is that this is this is graffiti, and in its rarest form. This is the real hip-hop. This is the essence right here. When you see that other graffiti, like gang graffiti, like just like scribble on the wall and numbers and all that kind of stuff, like uh, you know. Billy loves Susie. Now that's that's negative stuff because they'll write that anyway. You know what I'm saying? But if you see if you see true graffiti, you don't see it on like uh, I wouldn't say I mean, you wouldn't see it on a big corporate wall unless somebody paid you to do it. You know what I mean? It ain't this stuff what you see right here is not it's not trash. Verse one has been in the game for a while, so his name is known throughout the city. To him, that's a very gratifying level of respect because writers come and go all the time, but only a hand few are ever remembered. You'd be amazed at how many people see what you do and, 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 and know about you and you don't even know about it. You know what I'm saying? You're just doing it because it's something you like to do, but you got other people out here that's just like, to, like to see your work, like anything else, you know what I'm saying? So, it's amazing, man. It's amazing to, to see people come through here and be like, man, I wish I could meet that dude. And, this. and I just sit back, I lay back and listen to people and say, I'm over here, man, you know what I mean? So they be like, oh, for real, man, can you sign this? Can you do this? Can you do that? So this is, it's all fun, man. That's how we do it down here in B-Mall. One liner, baby, one liner. See this here? You see that? That's a one liner right there. That's my tag right there, son. When you see that, when you see that, represent. So the next time you're driving downtown and you see a graffiti piece that you like, take a closer look at it. And if it's signed verse one, you know who did it. Baltimore's finest graffiti artist.